What's going on guys? I hope all is well. Welcome back. And of course, if you are new here, welcome. My name is Quartzle and today, today I'm bringing you a brand new video for a brand new series. I know, holy cow. If you cannot tell by this creepy, creepy music in the background, we are coming in strong with some Alan Wake 2. The killer left the heart next to the body. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual. A page of text written with a typewriter. Someone's been watching us. How do you run from an idea? From a story that lives in your head? I need to escape this nightmare. Wake says a story will change reality around us. Super excited. I remember when Alan Wake, the first Alan Wake came out. Oh my gosh, I was head over heels in love with that game. So uh, needless to say, I've been very, very hyped for this game. All right, I got something on my face. Gosh, let's just dive right on in normal because I'm not entirely a wussy. All right, just a tad, just a little bit. We all come to a story with hopes and expectations, looking for an answer. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it would be better to live with that hope without ever knowing the full story. Oh. Where are you going? You disappeared. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. This is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. This story- Oh, is it's a reflection. This story is a monster. Monsters wear many faces. Monsters do wear many faces, yes. Naked man on my screen. <laughs> if you didn't think you were signing up to see booty cheeks today, me neither, but we're doing it together. That's all that matters, alright? Alright, let's go. He's a hairy, hairy man. atmosphere dude this is insane oh hey help question mark possibly um hello how are 
how are you gonna see a naked man and just dip, bro? I would be calling the cops or something. Where do I go? Hello? Do I just keep going straight? What was that? Chill out. I don't like this. Stop. Stop it. <laughs> Stop. God. <laughs> Fucking. <it>. Sorry. <clears throat> Okay. <laughs> anyway, I was not prepared. I was not prepared for that. God, man. Put my boobs go up to my throat. <laughs> Golly. Um, SOS? Please help? Please? Um. This game is gonna be the death of me, I swear. Just run, dude. Run for your freaking life. Alright? You don't want your booty cheeks clapped today. Ooh, headlights. So we're good. We're not good. We're not good. Can I... I'm so on edge. got violated in every which way possible. Alan Week 2. Yeah. Tell ya. It was, uh, it was something. I feel like I'm watching a hey, movie. Hey, How are you? I'm good, Mom. How are you? This trip might take a little longer than I thought. Hmm. I'm sorry I've been gone so much lately, Logan. Oh my god, Mom, it's not your fault. People get all murdery. What happened? Get all murdery? Just look <laughs> No. Well, Dad and I are just watching the latest episode of Night Springs here. Mom, it's so good. No spoilers. I'll let you get back to the show. You were supposed to wait and watch with me. Oh. Busted. This is what happens when you go on work trips, Mom. Love you too. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Stop Logan. brooding so much. I will. Bye, kiddo. Logan.
Logan thinks you should try cheering up. <laughs> Snarky kid. I wonder where <laughs> she gets that from. Young in sync? <laughs> Drinking coffee at the same time? It can't be a coincidence that another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. You should take lead. Think of me as the backup. Okay. Is that... Any words of advice? Okay. <laughs> Nothing that would cheer anyone up. All right. There it is. <laughs> Here we are. Aldrin Lake. Time to get to work. A deputy was um, supposed to be here to show us to the crime scene. I'm pretty sure you just had an FBI There's jacket. There's the car. So but where's right. the deputy? <laughs> Eaten by a bear. Eaten by I'll a check bear. Check out that map. Return one invitation. Ooh, map. Map displays key locations in the area. I think I hear someone. Could be our deputy. I can go take a look. Look at you throwing stuff away. I'm proud of you. Wait. Hey, over here. Your voice just changed to a whole new octave, hey, my guy. Agent Casey, right? Sheriff Raker said you'd be coming by to take over the case. Hello? You're half right. Anderson. What? Sorry. I'm goofing. Hey, hey. I'm in charge here. Saga Anderson. I'll be leading this case. Seems you already know my partner, Alex Casey. Shoot. Why we got Sorry so about close. that, ma'am. I'm Deputy Mulligan. I just figured that, you know, that, uh... Those damn fits gonna show up, Mulligan? Federal agent's right here, Thornton. My partner, Thornton, <laughs> down at the crime scene. He's not what you call you the sharpest really? axe in the shed. Right here? Yeah, I'd Where say so. Are they with you? Oh, shit! They didn't hear me, did they? We did. We did, Thornton. What can you tell us about the crime scene? Any briefing? I was getting to that, Thornton. Thornton, just shut up, bro. <laughs> well, we reckon there are some uh, organs that are currently outside the victim's person when they should be, well, you know, inside. Why was that so hard for you to say? Were there any witnesses? Yeah. Couple out of towners. I wonder what they were doing sneaking around the woods at night. He just did, bro. Anything against city folk, right, Thornton? But don't worry. Sheriff Breaker took him back to town a while ago. Let's take a look at the body. I want to see yes. the body. How do we get there? I'm glad you oh, want to see sure, the body. Oh, sure, that's real simple. Just through the <laughs> hole in the fence, down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store. You can't miss it. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. Mm. The store, the campground, all of it. Okay, but why was it fenced off? That's the question. Why was it fenced off? Thank you, sir. As far as uh, your buddy Thornton there, he's kind of annoying. <laughs> Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Mm. Make sure okay. I'm seeing the clues clearly. Uh, you can access the case board inside the mind place. The mind place. My version of the mind palace technique. To sift through clues and work the case. Building mm -hmm. the mind place again for each case using each field office as a model in my head. The facts are on the board. All right. <laughs> Everything we know about the previous murders. Worth taking another look. 
The case board is a mental technique that allows Saga to analyze clues and progress the investigation. You can use R2 to move around. Use R2, L2 to zoom. Victims? Question mark. Okay. Cool. Uh, all victims reported missing in 2010. No other commonalities. Ted Lane, dentist, stab wounds, bloating, bruising on the wrists. Wendy Davis, teacher, body bloated, large chest wound. And Percy Wolf, store owner, bruising, heart removed, and strange. Oh, so this does say something different. The victim is reporting missing in 2010, discovered in a 2012, buried in a shallow, shallow, it, shallow grave. <laughs> Found in Cauldron Lake, 2018, some organs missing. Predate, predation? Predation? Brett? I'm, st I'm stupid. The state of the body does not match eight years spent in a lake. Dude. Found two weeks ago, chest wound was ruled as cause of death. Tattooing on the body is. What did that say? Eligible. Oh, eh. Murder method? Question mark. Slight difference in murders, bloating only commonality in bodies, but not cause of death. Chest trauma, exposure to water post mortem. <laughs> Two of the victims had bruising, some form of restraint, strapped or belted down. Bloating of the corpse is indicative of drowning, but only one victim was found in water. Most recent victim died of major chest trauma, consistent with two 2018 victim. Hard to confirm due to condition of body. Killer profile. Post warm tattooing. Victim number three was covered in eligible tattoos, a message from the killer, maybe, or their arch. Apart from going missing in 2010, the victims have nothing apparent in common. And killer may be a sportsman or a hunter. Animal butchery techniques. Ooh. All right. Am I am I missing? I see you're already hard at work, Anderson. Oh my god! Close to cracking bro. it. We're just getting started. Visiting Let's head down the hill to the crime scene. The game, so be mindful of your. Fucking nature gives me a headache. It's too much sky. Got what? Too much sky. Are you listening to yourself? <laughs> Too much sky. Is that even a thing? I don't. Can't go up there. What about this way? Can I go this way? What's over here? Is there anything up here? I'm gonna go check something out. Be right back. Got it. Ooh. I'll come back for you. A creepy twig sculpture? All right. Hey, Casey. You putting me hey. in charge. Why now? Look, Anderson, you're a better detective than I am. You've cracked cases that have the rest of us baffled. I don't want to slow you down. Are you thinking of retiring? Which will be you know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm-hmm. There's a hike Real day funny, Anderson. Away. Missing Doberman found on the trail. Chaos at Cauldron Lake. Uh, late night fishing was violently disrupted Saturday as a mysterious assailant. Assailant! Golly, attacked park visitors. 
causing chaos and destruction. Abbott's the incident left three people injured, one of which had been admitted to the county hospital. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, well. All right, well, I guess, um, what's over here? Oh my gosh, there's so many trails. Hello? I'll be back in a second. Roger. Ah, I'm just stupid. We were on the radio. Sorry, Casey. I'm just, I'm a nosy son of a gun, all right? Don't need to jog to get ahead of me, though. Please. Listen. If you know me, I try to Stairs do everything out. possible. You okay to jump down in a game? I'm not that old. So like, I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> not that old. <clears throat> Mirror Peak. Mighty Mountain in the distance is no other than Mirror Peak, the iconic landmark overlooking Cauldron. Uh -huh. Cool, cool. Hmm. Hey, man. What's over here, Casey? I think I saw something. It'll only take a minute. I'll wait here. What's up here? <laughs> the game said mm, no. Alright then. Fine. Rude. Hmm. Watch me just watch it take me to where I'm supposed to be. Oh god, I don't want to get lost. <laughs> what is that? Is that a kid's lunchbox? An Alex yes. Casey movie lunchbox. My dad used to say when Casey the hates the endless jokes about coincidentally having the same name as a fake detective. <laughs> he hates those cheesy crime books, but he really hates the movies. When the going gets tough, the tough gets going. I'm not sure where the tough get going to. What? I'm not sure where the tough get going to, but maybe you'll find it inspiring. Oh, I get it. Oopsies. Manuscript fragments can be used to upgrade weapons in the mind place. Ooh. I only have two, though. Why would you even tell me if I don't got enough? Oh, I wish it would tell me, like, where Casey was. Oh, wait a minute. location oh that's the murder site gotcha gotcha murder falls this powerful feat of nature will revive the spirit as it does the surrounding nature Hmm. Alright. 
This will probably take me to Casey. Yeah. Did you get lost, Anderson? No. Not a bad place to get murdered. Hmm. If getting back to nature is your thing. Great. I can't get over that he said too much sky. Who says too much sky? Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. Girl, you literally the only thing around here that feels like jacket. home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. If they did, you already know me. On me. Not gonna follow him. Just hut. I'll look around. See you in a bit. Take your time. Ooh. What is this? I'm gonna need you to chill out. I don't like that noise. Our fall. Mm -hmm. Chill out. Oh. What is this exactly? Friday. Oh, no, stop it. Is told me today that her family is moving away. This sucks. I haven't even told her that I like her yet. Disappointed anymore. She said her parents want to get better jobs and get her to a better school in a big city. I guess that's fair. Who wants to stay in bright fucking falls? Sunday. So I told her. She said thanks. Fucking kill me. <clears throat> Monday. I snuck out last night again. Went to the big house by the lake instead of just watching it from here like I always do. Instead of just sitting around, like I always do, screw that. <laughs> anyway, something... Stop it. Something weird is going on there. I'm going to find out what. Going to go back there tomorrow with better gear. I bet I can find a way in. Am I tripping or did I just hear something? Uh, I bet I can find a way inside the building. Take some photos. It's going to be epic. Who is that? A lunchbox again. Where? Who's leaving these out here? Okay, but where do you see the lunchbox? Oh. What is that? I was waiting for her to say something. I know things can get a little crazy around here, but if you're ever feeling scared, just remember that. Alan is watching over us. What? What? Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. Anything else? Anything at all? Eh, uh, probably not. Not at this spot, anyway. Stop it. <laughs> mm hmm. All right. My question is, is, where do those stairs lead to? So, I'm not scared to admit. One piece, Anderson. Forest can be a dangerous place. I think that is where the body is, right? So I want to walk around for a minute. You know where to find me. Deputy Thornton, I take it. All right. That's me. At your service. Do this first. Ready to get this fine. case solved. Now the body's behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. Oh, okay. So, 
FBI, huh? Yo. Yep. So cool. Hunting you already know. Psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob. You forgot the UFO cover ups. What? Those are real? You guys hiring? Oh, my God. Let's just see this body, shall we? Ooh, there's so much to walk around. Now, this is the scene of the crime. We found him on the table. Now, we didn't touch nothing, you know, procedures and stuff. Thanks, Deputy. No car. So you owe me a coffee. Okay. Let's start by examining our guest of honor. Does this fit the MO of the previous murders? Uh, absolutely. freaking lately. Yes, it does. Step one. Body is positioned on the table. Ritualistic. It will knock your first key image. You can place it on the case board inside the mind place. Ultra Lake murder scene. Another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Coincidence? Of course not. Or maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Placing a key image on the case board begins a new line of investigation. When a key image is placed, it will prompt a new question. Another body has been found in the woods near Bright Falls. Perfect timing. You need to see if this is linked to the killings. We're here to investigate. Alright. Cases? Goals? Sorry. You are not free to examine the case board. For sure, for sure. Finding a Casey movie lunchbox out here can't be a coincidence. Another message? What is that? Bright Falls area? Question mark. What does that even say? Cauldron Lake area? This one goes up here, right? Okay, okay. Aldrin Lake. Okay, the writer of the note is leaving these to inspire someone. Are they really for me? The note inside mentions Alan, Alan Wake. What the hell are these? Ooh. You can collect clues from the body to progress the investigation. The killer left the heart right next to the body. But they did. Poor man. Inside stab wound. Chest cut open. Heart removed. Bruising on the wrist from the cargo straps holding him down. Uh, it wants me to go to the case board again. Of course it's consistent. Look at these freaking photos. Heart removed from chest, strapped by the wrists. Definitely matches the previous murders. But this time the heart and the straps were left behind. More clues to work with. This makes four murders that we know about. The clues have been resolved. The open question unlocked a deduction. As you advance the investigation, new questions will be unlocked, updating your goals. Learn more about the victim. Learn more about the killer. Who is our victim? Who killed him? Need to find more clues. Large amount of blood on the table. The victim died here. Have you identified the Any victim? idea who the victim is? Oh, I sure do. His name is Nightingale. He was FBI. He came to town about 13 years ago. Now, I haven't heard a word about him since. Well, until now. Nightingale? Robert Nightingale? Oh, yes. You probably knew him. Brothers in arms. Oh, and sisters. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Clues can be discovered by speaking to people. As so well you as knew our victim. 
Well, I didn't recognize him in his current state. But yeah, I ran into him a few times at Quantico. Never worked any cases together. After his partner got killed in the field, he went off the deep end. Got the boot pretty quick after that. It happened after he got fired, so he's been missing since 2010. So what happened to Nightingale after the Bureau let him go? I only know the rumors. Depression led to booze, booze led to paranoia. He got some wild ideas in his head, chased ghosts until he fell off the map. Guess he ended up here. I bet there's more to that story. But no happy ending. Nightingale went missing 13 years ago, 2010. The same as all the other victims. Certainly fits the pattern. Makes me wonder what was going on that year. Probably something this town wants to forget. <laughs> yeah, for real. There's one. Multiple two, people were here. Three. Multiple killers? Four. Tripod? Was that a tripod? Someone left in a hurry. Knocked the tripod over. There was one over here. Was it for a camera? Probably. Someone was drinking beer. They spent time here. Waiting. I think that's everything. For now, at least. Mm-hmm. Anything clicking yet? Not sure. Need to think about it. Icons on the bottom left corner indicate that critical content is available in the place. Okay. I had to review the clues. Okay, but can you give me a minute? Wonder what's inside. I should take a look around for a way to open this thing. Confused? Follow these steps. Wash your hands. Take the chicken out of the fridge and take a nap. Alright, first let's just do this so she does not bug me about it. Alright. <laughs> Multiple facets of footprints that probably belongs to the killers, right? A uh, nightingale went off the deep end, the victim. Also goes there. Robert Nightingale, ex FBI, came okay. to Bright Falls 13 years ago. The victim, victim ID'd Robert Nightingale, former FBI agent, mental state questionable at the time of disappearance. Heavy blood splatter. Evil. Ugh. Huh. Boot prints indicating multiple killers. Quite the party. I'm trying to figure out how the heavy blood splatter on table has anything to do with the killer. Like, how does that help you see who the killers are? We meditated or spent. They planned for the murder to happen here. Definitely planned. Passing the time with equipment ready. They were waiting for him. Mm -hmm. But why Nightingale? He's been missing for 13 years. Why here? Why now? Victim came from where? Profiling. Get into the subject's head. See what they saw. Feel what they felt. Use whatever I know about them to guide my intuition to a revelation. Piece it together. Using her intuition, Saga can discover new clues by profiling people of interest. Missing person. Agent Nightingale has been MIA for 13 years. 13 years. How did he end up here? Depression. Up from the lake that's not a lake. It's dark. He was Creepy there voice. too. You are not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. Robert Nightingale came from the lake before his murder. Babe, if that's like your inside voice up here, okay, that's some 
Nightingale was chosen Scary. as the victim. Why? Flip the switch. It goes click. Lights are off. But somebody's home. Somebody's home. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual. A Nightingale a component. They didn't see him as a person. More like a container for something. That is... I didn't feel the Nightingale came from the lake, but why now? After 13 years, where's he been? The lake know, is connected girl. to Nightingale somehow. Casey, let's take a look down by the lake. We Lead the way. Wait a minute. Sounds good. Uh, this way, right? Right. Well, okay. Wash your hands, well, take the I'll chicken out of the fridge, I'll and pick it here. Here. I'm gonna go check something out. Be right back. Got it. Where are you jerking? Oh. Oh. Hey there, Mr. Deer. You remind me of a dream I had. Wait, was the beginning of the game a dream? Like, as far as Alan Wake, they said wash your hands. There's a sink right here. Look at these symbols. Are these symbols... Okay. So, wash your hands was first. So that means the up down triangle. Then they said to take it out of the fridge. Where are you? I'm stupid, so I think I'm just gonna do one at a time up down. This one, it was that one, right? Take it out of the fridge and take it out. So, double check. Chill out. No one asked, all right? The left, right. Let this be a warning to you, fellow trespassers. They say the lake is a caldera, something formed by an erupting volcano or the sinkholes it leaves in wake. But what if that's not true? What if it's something else, something less natural and much more man-made intentional? I say the lake's not formed, it's designed, and it has a purpose. The lake is a hiding place. Beneath the calm surface lies a secret machinery ready to be activated at the press of a button. All right. And the people with the button, they're in that big house by the lake preparing. I know it. First drawing, waterline. Real caldera is made from a volcano lava. Okay. Second drawing, waterline engineered structure, strange machines. Oh. Hey, Casey. Did you see that? What's the forest's favorite shape? Please, Anderson. Just one case without the ridi- A triangle. I don't get it. Yes, you do. A triangle? I'm so done. Is that not right? Don't take anything if you aren't one of the trees. Well, I'm not. That sucks. 
stash out. Casey, where are you? What's that? I love the fact that it's like low key open. Like you can go wherever. For the part of the like... Ooh, what's over here? Ooh. Hello, this is Agent Anderson and Agent Casey, FBI. We'd like to come in and ask a few questions pertaining to an investigation. Rude. Nice talking to you, too. Uh, rude. going honestly I'm just kind of running you know what's over here what's this UFOs really writing this down in case it happens again I forget Ooh, what does that say I got that feeling again it hit me suddenly at 1 15 a.m. after I'd finished my ama on the porch of the trailer I got in the car and drove cashing it Cashing. Chasing it. Jesus. You know what's on my mind? <laughs> uh, starry night. Not much moon, as expected. It led me past Bright Falls to Cauldron Lake. I tried to find the right spot, the right emotion, the right thought. The combination to have it all aligned to make it happen. Terrified it would, it didn't. Not this time. Frustrated, but relieved. I scanned the sky for the shapes, the objects, nothing. But then... But when I blink repeatedly, I think I saw the afterimage of an octahedron. Octahedron? It faded fast. When I got ready to drive back, I felt someone watching me here, but not here. It's him. I know it is. Does he know I'm getting close? I'm on the right track. I was right to come to Bright Falls. Mm, ooh, another one. How do you like the knitting, hero? I made it just for you. I'll be able to upgrade my gun in no time. Remember Ohio? Sure. The north side slasher. But that case was completely different. The trees, Anderson. He hid the bodies in the forest. Of course it's Ohio, bro. <laughs> of course it's Ohio. What's over here? There's no way. This leads to nothing. Huh? Did you get lost, Anderson? Don't hate! I'll be back in a second. Roger. I don't even know where you is. Just trying to find things, alright? That's all I'm trying to do. Make sure I don't miss anything. Because I always do. Never fails. Is that the trailer? Yes, it is. One of your hunches, Anderson? Did something happen at the lake? I think Nightingale came up from that direction. From the lake. Oh. Probably sure. looking for shelter. Safety. They were waiting for him. When you're ready, I'd love to hear what you put together so far. Oh, God! Sure. 
Dude, why it's does he not that complicated. scare the shit out of me? Nightingale was out in the woods alone at night, possibly nude. The killers knew he was here, ambushed him, dragged him to the campgrounds, strapped him to the table, cut his heart out. But then they were interrupted by those witnesses, the bookers. The job is unfinished. Is this that seems pretty complicated to me. What was this guy doing skinny dipping at this time of year? I haven't skinny figured dipping. that part out yet. Mm-hmm. Lots of questions. Which is lots of answers for us to find. Battle, it'll ever. Good to see you still in one piece, Anderson. Forest can be a dangerous place. Dude, I've I literally didn't been no trees got that big. Ooh. Gives me the creeps. You need to get out more. It is kind of creepy though. Tracks. Barefoot. Nightingales? Ooh. They come out from under the boulder. It makes no sense. There's a piece of paper on the ground. Can you pick it up? No? Oh. Alright, bye. Be the way. A page full of texts on one side. Not a printout. Written with a typewriter. Old school. Lines scratched out and edits added with a pen. Mm hmm. Like a manuscript. A page of a story. Hmm. Killer left a message. It's for us. The text excuse is me? about us. Oh, excuse me. I watched the victim was one of their own. <laughs> FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. And then there was the page they found. The first step down into terrifying depths. Reading, Reading the, the words. words. These, These words, words felt like a message. Felt like a message. Someone knew they were here. Someone playing a game with them. An invitation. How could they not accept? Even if they knew it would end up hurting them. Someone's been watching us. Playing a sick game with us. You were right. This is right up my alley. Nightingale came this way. Either he dropped this page, or the killers left it for us. Ooh. I should profile Nightingale about this page. You absolutely should in just a minute. I think I, I saw think so. something. It'll only take a minute. Always here. Can't go any further. Water's too deep. Him. But this is not where he came from, right? I'm not stuck or unsure, all right? I'm just, I'm just looking. That's what I'm doing, game. What was that? I'm tripping. It's fine. Yeah, I'm tripping. Seriously? Good to There's see nothing else over here. Anderson. Forest can be a dangerous place. Oh, is that the witch's hut? Is it? I'll look around. See you in a bit. Take your time. Uh, so th but that's where it goes to. Is the lake. I'm scared. Jesus, what the? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you can close doors. Interesting. Well, you know what? I'm 
feeling pretty safe in that world, that, right? I mean, let's hope. So it looks like there's one more for profiling him. We found a page in the woods. A story about these events. What is Nightingale's role in this? I carry his words close to my chest now. Inside. The awful truth. You must dig it out. Something was put inside him. In his chest. I must find out Ooh. what. Your dirty dogs. Manuscript. Leading them on an invitation, how could them not accept the sheer audacity of this impossible mystery presented to them? Felt like a message was a message, not the last. Victim came from footprints emerging from under the rock, which was super sketch, super sketch. Trail has gone clear. And a little. Uh, I think he came from the lake, but his tracks make no sense. Too many unknowns doesn't make sense. Asking wrong questions? Question mark. Not you, gal. Has something hidden inside of him? Does this go here? No, duh. Of course, it's not yellow. I'm stupid. Uh, anything else here? Yes. All right. Found Let's all talk. I can here. Time to properly examine the body. See what I can find inside. That's it. The note inside mentions making knitting just for me. How do they know I knit? Oh, maybe just a coincidence. I don't like how far. So I'm guessing that means I can find two more, right? All right, so it looks like there is a total of eight lunch boxes at Cauldron Lake and seven lunch boxes at bright falls what about this one down here who left these two people it looks like so casey i think something's been put inside nightingale's body let's tell the deputies to get the body to the town morgue okay what are these question marks point of interest what does that mean why? Container? Point of interest? I'm confused. Is this? Hmm. Is it this map? Is is this map? Does I'm I don't. I love the witch of Cauldron Lake. Be where her spirit may still still haunt this place. Stop. Did you know this entire area is inside a caldera? This whole mountain used to be an active volcano. Imagine the force it took to carve this crater out of the earth. Caldera is a pretty rare, so be sure to take it in. So, essentially, we're standing in the gaping maw of hell. You got it. <laughs> I used to love geology when I was in school. I helped Logan build a great baking soda volcano for her science fair. Cheating on a science Why am I still holding the flashlight out? I don't know where I'm going. Am I going the right way? I don't think so. Casey, where are you? Did you know this entire area is inside a caldera? This whole mountain used to be an active volcano. Imagine the force it took to carve this crater out of the earth. 
Caldera is a pretty rare, so be sure to take it in. So essentially, we're standing in the gaping Ooh, maw here? of hell. You got it. Mm. I used to love geology when I was in school. I helped Logan build a great baking soda volcano for her science fair. Cheating on a science fair? That's almost a crime, Anderson. I'm not gonna say no to quality time with a volcano. I mean, my daughter. They left a lot of garbage. Not the fastidious type. I want to walk around for a minute. You know where to find me. Nothing in there. Can I walk through here? Nope. Rude. I think that's all the lunch boxes we'll find for now. But hopefully we'll hey, come back here. You made it back. Here. Good. I hope you didn't get stuck in any of those big puddles. Crazy flooding down there, huh? Just like I said. Let's get the body back. Deputy, I want the body taken back to town for a proper examination, ASAP. Well, sure, but the coroner won't be back in town for another week after Deerfest. Not a problem. I'll do it myself. Oh, and Sheriff Breaker called to say he's got the bookers at the Oh Dear Diner in town. Oh, and I've got a key to the gate. It's a shortcut back to the parking lot just up the hill. Like that? Thank you. Thanks. All right. Come on, Kelsey. Let's get the car, drive to Bright Falls, and talk to these witnesses, the bookers. At the diner, right? I, I could use a cup of coffee. Let's try that shortcut the deputy mentioned. Sounds good. Felt. Felt. Seems like a nice town so far. Where are we aside. on that? Deputies, doubt they see much Remember stuff. Remember, you this can gruesome. click access them. I know. I just did it. <laughs> Another lunchbox. Are these Easter eggs? They look like it. We're all in this together, hero. Have a heroic day. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, Kelsey, let's go. Can't fit the clues all together yet. Heart removed, tripod, tracks leading to a dead end. A tripod for a camera? That's what I'm saying. To record a, a snuff film? Maybe. And why take out his heart just to throw it away? To stuff in something for us to find. I'm gonna go check something out. Be right back. Got it. Speaking of people, saw some drunk guys staggering in the forest earlier acting weird. Maybe drugs kept my distance. Should probably find another spot. So annoying. This is my truth. After I saw that weirdo guy, I decided to change spots again. Moved up the mountain a bit. Found a fantastic overlook to camp. At, but I'm more interested in this Aska onion grass invasive but edible rising they see. Started hearing wolves or wild dogs minutes ago, but they sound wrong. 
baby is about to leave, but the stupid phone is dead. Gonna hide in the tent and hope they go away. Something is really not right about this. You are correct. Good job. I would have to stay the same. Honestly. Where does this go? Go out of nowhere, I guess. <gasps> Can I go up? Yeah, I'll see. Here we are. Let's drive back to town and meet the sheriff at the diner. Where, Where am I? Rental cabin. This way. I'll be back in a second. Roger. Thornton told me we're shipping the body out. We'll, we'll take care of that for you. Don't you worry about that. Get proper police work. <laughs> you can trust us like you can trust the, um, uh... The blossoming pepper lilies in spring. That was beautiful, Thornton. Oh, God. Why not go to Welcome these... Welcome back, Anderson. Hi. It's this way. If you guys enjoy... Game said nope. If you guys enjoy me, like, exploring the game for what it is, please let me know. I don't just want to be walking around and you guys could honestly care less, so... Yeah, please let me know. I would appreciate it. But let's continue forward. I can't get that manuscript page out of my head. I've never seen killers reach out so directly before. Damn impressive work so far. With your technique, these hunches were moving fast. I wasn't sure about taking a case so far from home, but... I'm thrilled to be here for this mystery. Thrill. She's thrilled. Oh my, what are they? Can you swing by the lodge to get anything from the field office? No, I'm all set. I'll park there anyway. I want to walk to Is the that diner spray? and get a feel for the town. I don't know. So take me, yes, I don't even know if that's a thing. The diner's just up the waterfront. Shouldn't keep the sheriff and our witnesses waiting. I smell coffee. Coffee. All right, you guys, I think this is a good place to end this part for now. Already right off the bat, beautiful, beautiful game. We did see some butt cheeks and a uh, little, little something else. But other than that, other than that, fantastic game so far. Very, very, very excited to see how the storyline is going. Rest, see when Alec is going to come in the... Alec? When Alan is going to come in the picture and everything like that. But, as always, if you enjoyed this video, please let me know down below by liking, commenting, or subscribing if you haven't already. Why freaking not? You've stuck around this long. You might as well just boop, make that red button gray. Uh, I think that's white. So I hope to see you next time. And of course, all love. Love you guys so, so, so much. And peace.